Sorry about the first couple of minutes of the video, guys. So I was filming with this camera that I'm using right now and apparently don't know how to use it right. Welcome back to the channel, guys. We're here with Tony, got the homie. What's up, guys? So we're about to go get some fun, but today I got some new hood risers that just came in for the Del Sol and uh, one of the the rear splitters on the wing actually fell off, so we had to clean that up a little bit and put that back on. Also, one of you guys noticed that on my passenger side door, the handle was broken. So, you guys came over, hooked me up with a new door handle, and we put that back on. So, stay tuned to the video. Alright guys, so we just finished up at the Fub restaurant. We're gonna head back over to my place to pick up my car and then we're gonna head over to the shop and get everything else installed. But first, check out Tony's bus house ride. <laughs> uh, Do you like my the window steelies. wheels? They pimped the car out. That's full Mexican right there. <coughs> full Mexican. Yeah. <laughs> Alright guys, we'll see you back at the shop. Alright, so we just got back to his garage. We got the car here ready. And we got the hood struts ready to get assembled. Alright, All right, so we got the hood strut here, shipped from Japan. Alright, got a little bit of Japanese instructions. We also got some a warning for something. If you guys didn't know, Japanese backing tape is actually some of the strongest tape in the world. So we got our hardware. Struts. What are these? I don't know what I do. Oh, a bunch of gibberish. Nobody needs that. <laughs> so, my guess is it's probably going to be replacing this bolt here. Then we just hook it maybe to the top of this part and then pop the hood struts on. This bolt. This one out. Hey, I'll hold the head real quick so it won't fall on me. Showing off with your new magnet, Matthew. I think that came from me. Did he steal from me? Did you steal that from Herbert? I bought it. Alright. Wipe <laughs> everything. Grab me one of the struts, please. One of these things? <laughs> That's not gonna work. I gave you both. There you, you go. want to put some of that um, grease in it, Matt? Looks like something to pull out of your ear. Some dirty ears, boy. You guys probably don't know this, but Matthew's actually been greasing ball joints for 26 years. 26 years. 26 years now, right? April 16th, right, when you started? Yeah, so professional over here. Matthew's a jack of all trades. Let's see how well he got it. Well, that wasn't even focused. Yeah, good enough. You know, it's good enough. And I'm not quite sure which way the struts. So I think the struts on the top. Pretty sure that's how it goes. Is that how it goes? Uh -huh. Maybe like that. Let's just pop them in and see what happens. Alright, oh, right, we got Master Mechanic Matthew on the job over here. He figured it out. We got this side done. Now we gotta get this side. 
You guys didn't know, Matthew's actually been a master mechanic for 62 years. Is that right? About 62 years? 49 years, but... 49, oh, uh, I'm sorry. I worked diesel mechanic for a while, so... Uh, we count that as just being a master mechanic. Okay, so when you're a diesel mechanic, it adds an automatic 10 years to your term. What about you? How long have you been a master? Oh, wait, you're not a master mechanic because you work for Subaru. <laughs> Shots fired. All the oh, Subaru guys please. out there is going to be pissed. Maybe I should cut that. that. How's that one look? Is that good? All right, let. Well, that one I still got to pop in the pin. Oh, let's uh, see. Let's All right, so we got the pin in, the struts are in. Let go. It holds the hood. Now let's see if it closes. Go ahead. Do the honors, Tony. How's it feel picking up? Nice. Go ahead and open it back up. Woohoo! There it yeah. is. Yeah! All right, so I'm going to turn did, it did, around. Did you okay. hear it? It's like... Yes, I heard the strut. Oh, All right, so we gotta put this back on and then put that door handle in. I think we're probably gonna wrap up the video after that, but I've been waiting so long for this. It finally happened. We got Millie here making a special appearance. Millie, say hi. Woo. Millie, say hi. I guess not. Tony over here killing the car again. Jeez. You know how to pop the clutch? Pop it. Why'd you hit the brakes? Pop it. Alright, so we got this car turned back around. And I cleaned out the hole a little bit better. So if you look at this one, the crush river actually didn't smash evenly inside there and it didn't close all the way, so that's why it popped back off. So I got a new one here. I'm going to go ahead and put it on and see if we can get it installed again. Alright guys, so I got the splendid rod to put back on. So, instead of using screws, I actually went with, what are these called? Carter pins. Carter pins, that's right. <laughs> yeah, so I just threw carter pins on, so that way if I ever need to pull this off for some reason, I don't have a screwdriver, and get it out. So, we have Tony turn it back around. I put on that passenger, passenger side handle, and we will probably call it after that. All right, so. I got the door handle off. And we got the new one here. So we got the new one here. What happened with this one was this broke right here and it wasn't able to unlatch the door. But apparently that happens a lot in the Del Souls, so now I just gotta Swap over the tumbler for the key over to this one and we'll put it back on the car. Alright guys, so we've been out here for a little while now. I finally got the door handle put back on. It's raining, um, wet, but so smooth. Thank you, Tony. Well, outro. Oh, it's too bright. They can't even see you. <laughs> you right, there you go. Big shots to Tony. Yeah. Helping out. All right, so. <coughs> yeah, check out all my other videos. You know, I've been doing a lot. Here's the, obviously, you, know, you guys seen the spoiler. I got the, the last video. I think it was us doing the front, the front bumper. You know, a couple other things, but. Yeah, I guess. Check out my page. Go. David underscore Hackett at Instagram. Yeah, I'll follow my page. Let's try to get to 250 subscribers. And we'll do, I was thinking this time, maybe a $100 gift card. Thanks again for getting me to the 100 subscribers. I really can't do it without you guys. So the next goal is 250 subscribers. I'll do a $100 gift card. 
once we hit that. I want to take the moment to thank you guys because without you guys, this won't be possible. I do appreciate all the likes, all the shares, the subscriptions. You know, you go to my Instagram, follow me there. And, you know, let's just try to keep moving until we get to the point where I can actually start getting paid from YouTube so I can start giving you guys bigger giveaways. I like to do $1,000 giveaway, $5,000 giveaway, parts, uh, merchandise, everything. So you guys, I can't do it without you. Please like, share, and subscribe. We'll all get there together. And I'll definitely try to make it happen. So I do appreciate it. I hope you guys all had a great Christmas. I'll see you on the next video. Thanks again.